giant Godo moment. So I have a scream up front, yeah. So let's take on Phoebe, the second member of the boy, use our uh, master of ghost type Pokemon. Let's talk to her. Ah, we're talking to her from the side. Ah, <laughs> I'm Phoebe of the Leaf Four. I do my I did my training on Mount Pyre. While I trained, I gained the ability to commune with ghost type Pokemon. Yes, I yes the bond and I I Let me try that again. Yes, the bond I developed with the Pokemon is extremely tight. So come on, just try and see if you can even inflict damage on my Pokemon. Okay, we'll we'll see about that. Let's do it. Let's go, man. Let's go. I called Phoebe a man. Okay, let's go, Phoebe. Let's go. That's better. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so he starts with Dusclops. Now, I don't really have a dark type Pokemon in the, or any dark type moves anymore, actually. <laughs> so, and the only effective move I have on a Pokemon that are ghost type is a Shadow Ball from uh, Twitch. But Twitch is psychic type, so like, you know, the ghost Pokemon can just probably use a ghost type move like Shadow Ball back on Twitch. So that's why I kind of uh, start with Screamo. I think Screamo still may versus ghost, but I can't even remember. So I'm going to just see how much the stealing does. This dust crop is this dust crop is level 48 and female, and uh, she has two of these actually. One's level 48, and I think the other one's level 51. So keep that in mind. Dust crop seven is a good Pokemon, honestly. I've never used one in a playthrough before, but I've heard it's really good, especially in like the fourth generation games, like Diamond Pearl and Platinum, specifically Platinum because you can actually catch a dusk, you can actually raise a dusk Nora and evolve the dust crops or dusk. Dust Skull and evolved into Dust Clops, or just a Dust Clops, just evolve uh, Dust Clops into a Dusk Nor. That's only a, that's a, it's a fourth generation exclusive uh, evolutionary uh, Pokemon for that family, for, this, for the Dust Skull family. Because originally in third generation, it's just Dust, dust Skull evolves into Dust Clops, and that's it. There's no Dust Nor. So yeah, let's use the Yellow Food, actually, what am I doing in the other pockets? Well, so because uh, that Dust Nor kind of confused, uh, yeah, I can confuse Screamer. Shadow Punch, okay, it's ghost to move, yeah. Okay, cool. Well, Screamer does resist. Nice, that was a good choice of using Screamo at first in this battle and sending out first. And the leading off with it, yeah. He's a nice confuser. Hopefully, another Steel Wing faints this thing. It'd be nice. You know, I'm just gonna keep on using my Yellow Foot no matter how many times you can confuse my Pokemon, jeez. Yeah, nice. Future Sight, okay. Yeah, watch out because that's a attack that will happen to one of my Pokemon later on. So that kind of stinks. Ah, oh, Screamo, you missed. Are you kidding me? And you can use Confuse Ray again. Come on. Don't waste your time using Confuse Ray and waste my time as well. I mean, come on. I'm just going to heal Confusion with my Yellow Fruit. Jeez. Future Side, but it failed. Okay, whatever. Yeah, Screamo took the Future Side attack. No. Okay, fine, I didn't do this. I thought I'd do a little bit more than that, but that's okay. Stealing hits this time. Let's get this Dust Cops to off the battlefield. <laughs> and then, by the way, it fainted. Good. I got my wish. <laughs> okay, she's about to use main net. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to Metroid and issue Surf on this thing. Bayonet's, Bayonet's a pure Ghost-type Pokemon. So, like, Dark-type moves or Ghost-type moves will be super effective on it. But I'm just going to use Surf on it. Yeah, this uh, Bayonet's level 49 and female, that's pretty cool. Let's see here. Oh man, it doesn't want to kill. Dang it. It's going to use Spite to, uh, to um, take away PP of Surf. Dang it. Good thing I have all those PP restoring items too in my bag. Let's waterfall it then. Okay, you can use a full restore. I see how you like Phoebe. Fine. It's fine. I mean, I'm in good shape right now, so do what you gotta do. Let's get to use another waterfall. There we go, nice. Awesome. The bayonet goes down. Sableye. Okay, we're gonna actually stay in with the Metroid. Sableye, since it's a stark and ghost type Pokemon, it doesn't have any weaknesses, but the way you can get to land a super effective hit on this thing is if you have a Pokemon that has Foresight or Odor Sleuth or something like that that identifies the Pokemon, then it, that gets rid of its ghost type, uh, half of its um, typing, I'm pretty sure, and then it's left to be a dark type, and then you can use Fighting or Bug type Pokemon. Or bug type moves to a uh, land super effective hits, but I'm just gonna go for a good old surf, see how much it does. Basically, if you don't have a that you know foresight or or um, any of that kind of stuff, then um just hit it with your most highest attacking moves. So yeah, let's go for the waterfall. 
it just shut up on Metroid, but I didn't do too much. So that's good. This Sable has also level 50 and female fighting. I already mentioned that. So yeah. Okay, I'm gonna use Bayonet again. I'm gonna stay in with Metroid. Yeah. She only has that Bayonet and then her other dust cops left, so that's good. It's good for the surf. Oh, I didn't learn my lesson though. It's probably gonna put in the yellow, late yellow or uh, early reds. So where it's gonna, where Phoebe's gonna use a full restore. I should have just used two waterfalls to paint it, you know? Yeah, I knew it. I didn't learn my lesson there. Jeez. Because Bayonet, they're both their Bayonets are level 49 and female, so. Basically the same kind of Pokemon, but it's just, I think they both, I think the two of them have different moves or something. I think that also put in the red. Shoot. Let's go for the Sludge Bomb and see what she does. Hopefully it'll faint it. It does. Awesome. Nice. I like it. Okay, we fully fever that to Dusk Ops. Yes, I'll switch Pokemon. Um, I think I'm gonna go Smoky. Let's go for the flamethrower. See how much it does. This Dusk Ops is level 51 in females. So that's pretty cool. Nice, nice. This guy's confused, Ray. Of course, you and your confused Ray. Hi, yeah, yeah. Let's go for the bag and use the yellow food again. There we go. Nice. Uh, I, I forgot I had an earthquake. Wow. Okay, yeah. Okay, it didn't do too much though, so that's good. Let's go for the fire. No, let's try another flamethrower actually. I put it in the deep red, so, so that's what I'm worried about. But I think she may be out of heal items. She may have another full story. I'm not sure. It's gonna confuse me again. It knows it probably can't be my Torque or my Smokey, so uh, it's gonna just stall really. Oh, it has a Citrus Berry. Shoot. Uh, yeah, all the Pokemon, um, like four members, their strongest Pokemon have Citrus Berries. Hey, yeah, yeah. Let's go for the Yellow Food then. And I'm gonna try to. <laughs> I'm gonna try to finish this with an Overheat. I coughed there. I'm gonna try to just finish with the Overheat now. So yeah. There's no earthquake, so that's cool, I guess. Yeah. Let's go for the overheat now. It hits, awesome. Let's see how much it does. I hope I didn't knock it out. It does. Smokey is pushed that country it falls, but um it's the end of the battle basically, so yeah, it is the end of the battle. Not, some, not basically, it is the end of the battle. We defeated Eagle Floor Phoebe, awesome. Oh darn, I've got I've gone and lost. Thanks for ten thousand two hundred pocket dollars. I guess since Screamer was part of the battle, um, it doubled the prize money with the ammo coins, so that's awesome. Yeah. There's a definition, uh, not, there's a definite bond between you and your Pokemon too. I didn't recognize it, so it's only natural that I lost. Yep, I'd like, I'd, sh I'd like to see how far your bond will carry you. Go ahead and move on to the next room. Okay, with pleasure. Thanks, Phoebe.